What's up boys? My name is Brian and today I'm going to be telling you about what the traditional and sweet style rooms look like and what you're going to need to bring. So we're going to start you off with the traditional. Come on in and I'm going to show you what it looks like. First part I'm going to show you today is our desk. The desk is a lovely place to eat, do your work, and you can decorate it however you would like. You could do your work over here with a MacBook or a computer, but we do have a lab for that, so you don't really need it. Over here, we have our closet space. I recommend you only bring seasonal stuff because there's some limited room. This is a shower cap for all your shampoo, conditioner, and soap and loofah needs. We have communal bathrooms here, so you're going to need to bring this. And you're also going to need a robe and shower shoes. This is a twin bed, but you can use twin or twin XL sheets. And if you like your mattress a little softer, you can always bring a mattress pack. You can always make sure that you have room for stuff like your refrigerator, your microwave, TV, fan, and stuff of that nature. So now I'm going to show you what the suite looks like. As you're walking in, you're going to notice a lot of cupboard space right here. I know what you're thinking. What about my refrigerator? And how big should it be? I'm glad you asked. So as you're looking over here, you'll see that 31 is a safe size to bring in. You still have a little extra room, but I wouldn't bring it too big. So as you can see behind me, I have two closet spaces. One for you and one for your roommate. So please just use yours. Over here, you'll see that your space is limited. So I recommend that you watch what you're bringing. For shoes, I'd opt to bring a shoe caddy or a shoe rack. It's really up to you. And you also have storage space up here. As a decorator's tip, I recommend you bring a tension rod to put a curtain up so that you can cover the stuff that you got in here. So unlike the traditional in the suite, you're actually going to have your own bathroom space. So it's important that you bring all the stuff that you need to be successful here. This includes, but it's not limited to, hand soap, towels, paper towels, toilet paper, toilet bowl cleaners, a plunger, shower rings and a shower curtain, possibly a floor mat. These are twin XL beds, so please make sure you're using the appropriate sheets. And like I said before, you can drop or lift the beds, whichever way you please. And you could also bring the bed risers and the mattress pads, if that's something that you see fit. When you're hanging stuff on the wall, please remember to just use the command strips and the painter's tape and absolutely nothing else. Also make sure that you bring your laundry detergent because we have laundry machines here. So you don't have to take your stuff home from mom and dad to wash every weekend. I'd like to thank you all for joining me today. If you have any other questions on what to bring, please visit this website right here.